bags here and oh my gosh this is like one of the most hyped trailers teasers I should call it that Riot has ever put out because it's a champion that people have been wanting and it's finally happening I'm just gonna play it first and then say a bit of what I want it to be and what I want to see from this new champion. No matter what planet, no matter what galaxy, and like gives me freaking chills just listening to it. Wonder. It's like so high. Some fall to their knees and worship. And this voiceover is. Behind walls and towers. But the thing they do best is beg for mercy. That grin and shit and the voice, it's just so perfect. It's just adorable. Okay, so, first off, it's not entirely unexpected because first they redid the Mount Targon story, they tweeted and Instagram and Facebook posted a little 15 second trailer of like stars moving and stuff with Pantheon just standing on a mountain and there was actually a riot post uh, about a month ago or something like that where they talked about developing a dragon champion and they said... Aoshin, the Chinese Thunder Dragon, whatever, he's pretty much dead. But they do have a new a Dragon Champion coming out at the beginning of the year, the first half of the year, and he's tentatively named Aurelian Soul, which, as we see, they kept that name. Aurelian Soul is a very starry and spacey type name, and guess what? Champions deal with space and stars and shit. Uh, Leona, Pantheon, and Diana. So, it was pretty cut and dry, like, expected, but at the same time, like, Holy hype. Like, let me actually... Let me pause right there so it looks a little bit better. But, now, what I want to see from the champion is I want a tank. I, like, I want a tanky, bursty frontliner. More so than anything, like, with how big he looks in this trailer and the freaking voiceover being so deep and, like, so commanding and everything, that's what I want from it, personally. Like, he just screams, like, frontline, tanky, just off of this, and the whole, like, how he laughs about them hiding behind defenses and how they beg for mercy and finds it adorable. I personally just, I'd really like it to be not a, a glass cannon because that doesn't seem to fit what this is going for. What I honestly am expecting though is a mid laner that's bursty. So, but I'm hoping that's not the case. I'm hoping the kit gets revealed soon. Um, not too horribly much to go off of, obviously, because whenever you consider Aoshin died and th gave birth to this, Aoshin was intended to be a bursty mage type, so kind of lends itself even more to expecting him to be a bursty mage, probably more so than a frontliner, but I don't know. I really, really like Shivana, for instance. I love just how she jumps in the back line. She's this big-ass dragon. She just fucks shit up and doesn't die. I want that on an actual dragon. I want it so bad on an actual dragon. That's always a dragon. Um... Oops, I accidentally changed to my Facebook. I forgot this tab is up here. Um, there's not too horribly much else to say about it. 
But yeah, let me know what you think in the comments or tweet at me or, you know, whatever you want to do. Be sure to like it if you like this video or want. And subscribe for more because I'm always doing stuff like this. And like I said, comment. And I'm open to discussion all the time. So until next time, peace out.